Hi, I'm Tom Urban. I retired from the federal government in 2007. I worked 42 years for the government, including two years with Senator Tom Harkin. But the most enjoy enjoyable thing I've had to do is delivering Meals on Wheels. It's my salvation. I enjoy it, and I think it's a help to the community and also the wonderful, vulnerable seniors. Hey, how you doing, guys? My grandson, Christian. How you doing, Kristen? Thank you. You happy to be Grandpa today, huh? Hi, I'm Marianne Beatty, and I'm the program coordinator for Senior Services of Alexandria's Meals on Wheels program. We're a nonprofit that works with the city to deliver meals to Alexandria seniors 365 days a year. Hi, I'm Dolores Veeman, and I am the volunteer coordinator for our Meals on Wheels program. I would like to introduce to you Tom Urban, our volunteer extraordinaire, and he will be interviewed by Douglas Maggs, one of our college-bound volunteers. Well, Tom, thank you so much for being here with me today. I have just a couple questions about your involvement with Meals on Wheels. Now, firstly, what brought you to Meals on Wheels? Over the years, I've had a concern about the, the nutrition concern for seniors. They seem so vulnerable to me. And what triggered that, I, had, I worked with a person in the Department of Education whose father died, and what the family did is say, please make contributions to Meals on Wheels, and that really stuck with me. And since then, when I retired in 2007, my neighbor who was with uh, coordinates for First Baptist Church asked if I would deliver with her crew, and I said yes. And so I've been doing it ever since. But I'm a free agent now. I do not. I'm not tied in with any group except whatever Dolores and, and uh, Mary Ann want me to do. Well, that's fantastic. Now, in general, in a given week, how often do you volunteer? How often do you deliver meals? On average, three to four times a week year round. I wish I could do seven times a week. Why should members of our community be encouraged to volunteer for Meals on Wheels? What, what's in it for them? What's the best part about it? Well, in the first place, it's not a hell of a lot of effort. You can deliver in no more than two hours a day when you do it, and then you have the privilege and pleasure of meeting the people and interacting with them who are very vulnerable, and they're so happy to be happy to see you and get the meals and it just feels good when you do it. Hey you guys, it's been fun, but I gotta go deliver mails and I'll see you later.